It's 5.40 a.m., time for a run. Imagine being woken by a gentle sunrise. Cool white light gradually brightens, luring you out of bed and into your shoes. You're ready to run and fully awake. It's amazing what the right light at the right time does for our bodies. When you get back from your run, the sun is up. As you walk in the door, the lights automatically respond to your presence and illuminate to just the right level of light without wasting energy by responding to the natural sunlight. Hi, I'm Neil Joseph, founder and CEO of Stack. Over the past year, we've been assembling a great team of hardware and software engineers from companies like Tesla, NASA, Google, HP Labs, and several others to help us deliver amazing products that will transform industries. So with the explosion of connected devices, we asked ourselves, what could we really focus on to make the biggest impact on our day-to-day -day lives? As it turns out, light plays a major role in our health and well-being. Our body's circadian rhythm, that's our cycle that helps control our uh, mental, physical, and behavioral well-being, is most influenced by light. As it also turns out, lights are the most common electronic devices in any building. Now, I'm sure you've all heard of smart lights, but they're not actually smart. They're really just connected bulbs that move the switch from the wall to our phones. They're usually complicated to set up and are just more trouble to deal with than the products they replace. So over the past year, we've been working really, really hard to develop technologies that combine the power of a commercial-grade lighting control system. That's a picture of one up there. And these usually cost hundreds of thousands of dollars to install into a simple, beautiful form factor. And today, I'm very excited to introduce the world to Alba, the world's first responsive light bulb. Alba embeds sensors directly in the bulb to automatically respond to ambient light, occupancy in a room, adjust its color temperature, and it, each bulb can <laughs> independently learn. Also, each bulb has embedded beacon technologies that will help provide unprecedented resolution and analytics. In our real-world pilot sites, we've been seeing energy savings of 60 to 80% over an LED, and all it took was screwing it in. So camera, please, I'll show you how simple this is to install. All you have to do is screw the light in, plug in the hub, and then with the tap of a couple buttons, setup can be complete. Slides, please. So from there, each bulb can automatically respond to ambient light to always maintain the right level of lighting without wasting any energy. Um, slides, please. Each bulb can automatically adjust its color temperature from a cool white light to a warm yellow to help keep our bodies on its natural circadian rhythm. Imagine waking up to grab that midnight snack or use the bathroom. Now Alba can help light the way instead of waking you up. And what I'm really excited about is hopefully in the next couple years, we can banish the phrase, remember to turn off the lights. <laughs> so with that, with lights being the most common electronic devices in any building and our patent pending sensor technologies, Alba will help form the backbone of a responsive sensor network in any building and help connect with other connected devices that will help make your experience better. All this technology is also applicable to commercial customers, whether it's enhancing brand experience, helping your employees be more productive, or just outright running your business more efficiently. This can all be done without a major facilities retrofit. And it also can help you comply with new light energy savings regulations like Title 24 in California. Over the next year, we will have the major formats of light bulbs and fixtures that will be usable in both the home and commercial space. And what we're very excited to be able to do is offer software solutions for our, for our commercial customers that include beacon functionality and high resolution analytics through APIs that have never before been possible. 
Consumers will be able to buy all the directly from our website or Amazon, and then commercial customers will be able to buy from leading lighting distributors. So today, please go to our website at stacklighting.com and pre-order the BR30 format or reserve one of the future formats. We know once you experience our technology, you will experience a better life through better light. Thank you. All right. Looks like they like it. Judges, what do you guys think? Maybe you could, uh, so I, I'd say I, I, I bought a half dozen of them. I put yeah. them in my house. Maybe you could walk through the experience of how it feels with, with the product. In, in so, life. yeah, that's a, imagine just waking up. You, we have a feature where you can set what time you want to wake up and go to bed. So let's say before you wake up, you're, it starts to come up with a bluer hue of light, which has proven to help wake people up and help you feel more energized. And then throughout the day, it can follow the natural sunlight to change its color temperature. And by the evening, a warmer, more yellow hue of light will really help you be able to go to bed, which just helps your overall well-being. Okay. So the, the main thing is that the, that the hue is the bulb, of the bulb is adjusting to the particular time of day and what's going right. on. Right. So. so the major advance that we've done is the embedded sensors, with light sensors, motion, um, and being able to tie all of that together. And I can make sure it turns off and on. Yeah. Because I have young kids and I leave lights on all night <laughs> right. in my house. And that's why it can learn. It turns itself off if there isn't motion. And, you know, and again, it's that feature that I was talking about. Imagine you have to get up to go, you know, take care of your kids before you go back to bed. Well, they'll come on just a little bit with their standard preset, and it'll be a warmer light so it doesn't wake you, your body up. And I can just buy this on Amazon today and screw it into my current light fixture and it's gonna work. Yeah, you'll pre-order today um, okay. on our website and then we'll begin shipping in Q1 2015. So, so smart devices are great when they're smart, um, but I have a, a series of Nest Protects at home yeah. that like to go off and tell me my house is on fire <laughs> when I'm in critical meetings. Um, and so, and so the, uh, my question is how, uh, I, like I, I come home and the context of what I want my light set at mm -hmm. Is, is very situation uh, dependent. I, I come home and, and I'm uh, bringing people from work or versus right. I'm on a date. Um, how, how, how does this function, how does it know that context and how does it work in an existing environment where I've got dimmers and switches and all kinds of things? Do I just have to give up on switching things and setting dimmers? So the, our bulbs will be able to work with all the common dimmers, but the idea is you would just leave it on. And what we have are pre-loaded presets. So the, the setup process, when you, when you screw Alba in, is you say, I'm a home, or let's say commercial. From there, it has presets that all the bulbs will work with. Or you can say, drag and say, this bulb is in the kitchen, this one is in the family room. And we have presets, and you can go and adjust it on the app if you want. Uh, as well as we have common presets. For example, you know, there's regular dinner mode in the family room, or you know, the dining room or there's kind of a more, you know, dinner, dinner party mode where it'll be a little bit softer and mm -hmm. not as bright. Do you think the big opportunity is, is commercial or residential? Like, which are you going to do first? We're going to do residential first. The reason is we're ready to do that and we need more formats of lights uh, and more time to build out some of our analytics for the commercial customers. So, marketing question. It's always a challenge yes. in the reinvention of everyday things to right. tell people what it is, right? Mm -hmm. So. I'm in the elevator, you got 15 seconds, what, do you, what is it? Alba is the world's first responsive light bulb that you don't have to touch an app and it will automatically adjust and respond to the environment. Okay, and then the question, so my, my life at home is never linear. It's right. Right on. So I, I, I wanna override the presets, what do I do? On that, so that's the reason we have the app. You could just go in and adjust any, all the way down to individual lights you can put them in zones or just overall. So if I'm in the family room and I gotta go find my phone and open up the app and I want, if I wanna mess with the lights, I have, to, I have to deal with it that way. Yeah, I mean, that's the same with any connected product. Yeah. But hopefully okay. in time that will change. Okay. So you, you don't, like, you, do you have these challenges where you get like out of sync, you have someone visiting your house and they use the switch by accident? And then you have to run around your house, turn all the lights on so that they turn off? No, I, it won't make a difference. That's the great part. So let's say you have visitors, they turn the switch off like normal. When they turn it back on, it will just go back to the default of whatever it should be doing at that time. 
How many of the, the sensors or the receivers do you need for a normal house or a business, right. or how does that? You only need one hub. Uh, we use Zigbee between the lights. Okay. And we use it in a mesh network, so whether it's a house or you know, a, a Costco, you'd only need one unit, and then it could go all the way. And when, it, when, you, when you do start selling the products, what do you think the price point ends up coming at compared with, say, uh, Philips Hue or some, some of these other smart lights that are out there? Are you pricing at par with that or slightly, slightly uh, slight premium to that or a slight discount to that? We're pricing it at $60 just like a Philips Hue. So it, same price, but you get much more functionality. What's the life, like, I, I know LEDs right. last forever, but I mean, what's the real, how long do they really last? Um, generally, the newer LEDs from higher quality suppliers will be 50,000 hours. So, you know, in a, in a home setting, you know, you're talking 30 plus years. In a commercial, if you were on for 12 hours a day, that'd be over 11 years. And is, and the, again, having just gone through a, a home renovation, yeah. uh, the, the challenge of getting LEDs to work correctly with dimmers uh, seems to be an unsolved issue. Would right. your recommendation just be abandon the dimmer? And so, Lutron is out of business now? Or, or are you gonna, how do you play nice with the, because it doesn't seem like the LED guys have, have figured that out yet. There, there are many types of dimmers, and so there's kind of a common core set that everyone tries to work with, and that's what we're trying to do as well. But ultimately, from there, we say, you know, get rid of the switch long term. That's our dream, you know, that truly responsive home. Well, right. I have a question actually yes. about the team. There are four of you. Are, yeah. are all four of you founders, and how long have you been working together, and why? what led you to this idea? Right. If, I'll make it quick. So. Um, the three, so Rob is our head of software, and Jovi is our head of hardware, and this started, um, I was at Tesla for the past about four years. I was sitting in the office building, and it was a bright sunny day, and I thought, why are these lights on at full power? Uh, why, should it, why can't they dim like our phones or TVs? No products were out there that could do it outside of really expensive systems, so I set about developing the technology, and I've recruited an awesome, awesome team. All right, so we're out of time. That was very cool. Uh, Stack, give it up for the